16 year old boy is in critical condition right now after being tased by police during a drug raid. Good evening. Thanks for joining us. I'm Deborah Nam. And I'm Steve Dunn. Oregon State Police say SWAT officers used a stun gun on the Salem teen because he was fighting them. K2's Bob High is live near Dorm Becker Children's Hospital in southwest Portland where the boy was taken. What's the latest on his condition tonight, Bob? Well, we just checked recently, Stephen. As Deb mentioned, we, uh, he remains in critical condition, Stephen Avila does. He was injured as police served search warrants at several Salem locations early this morning. There were people home, but no one inside the Salem house where the early morning raid happened would answer the door. 16-year-old Stephen Avila was here, apparently visiting at 6 in the morning, when an Oregon State Police SWAT team, like this one seen during a standoff in Columbia County last year, served a search warrant. I came out of the house, go to work, and there were cops everywhere. Ray Lambert lives just down the street. They were just milling around in the front yard, but I heard the bullhorn saying that they were serving a search warrant. The door of the house was open, and I see a guy and the ground and uh, Refugio Jacobo watched from his house across the street as officers tried to revive one person in the house. Uh, it looks like the 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 paramedic tried to to give a CPR. That was Stephen Avila. Oregon State Police say Avila was resisting officers and not following orders when he was tased like in this demonstration. <laughs> After struggling briefly, Avila collapsed unconscious. Oregon State Police declined any on-camera interviews about this case, saying it was an ongoing federal narcotics investigation. They've also turned over the investigation into the use of force against Stephen Avila and the tasing to Salem Police. Avila just finished up his sophomore year at South Salem High School, a teenager now clinging to life after his confrontation with OSP SWAT officers. The SWAT team member who tased that boy, 34-year-old senior trooper Jeremy Hassenkamp, who's been with OSP since 1999, was put on administrative leave. That's standard procedure. Two adults in the house were arrested. Neighbors say police took several rifles, possibly an assault rifle, from the home as well. There's no indication yet whether the critical injuries came from the tasing from Mr. Avila or they came from something else. Live near Dornbecker Hospital, Bob High, K2 News. We'll certainly follow this condition, Bob. Thank you.